Ons reis begin ver in die ou Kalahari. Gesondheid. Ons besoek die mense van Poulai, Rietfontein en Akskeen Pan. Ons kamp onder die sterre. Ons sien die effect van die Kalahari pijplein. Ons sluit die reis af by Riemvasmaak, net noord van die Garib. Nog het nou voel die thuis. Och, ons vrak nie. Maar kom kyk self, voetspore in Zuid-Afrika, maandagand om 7, net op SABC 2. And uh, SA Tourism has partnered with the long-running SABC2 travel documentary, Footspore. Now, the program has uh, been airing since 2000, and it's undertaken many an epic journey throughout the African continent, and has also recently ventured further abroad to Madagascar, India. But this year, the journey will remain within South Africa's borders, and uh, by so doing, we'll be showcasing local roads less traveled. And to speak to us more about what viewers can expect this season, we joined in studio by Daryl Erasmus, who's the Chief Quality Assurance Officer of the Tourism Grading Council of South Africa. Daryl, thanks for coming. Uh, firstly, as a South African tourism, what do you hope to achieve uh, by collaborating with Footspora? Morning. Uh, good to be in studio. So I think the, the important thing here is Footspora has over the years done an amazing job of, of putting the spotlight on, as it says, the lesser traveled uh, provinces, the lesser traveled cities, towns, little dorpies. And what we want to do as South African tourism is to amplify that spotlight and um, really get people excited about places they haven't been to before. So why we've partnered with them is uh, to uh, enable and, and encourage South Africans and give them you know, the, prop the, 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 the provinces and the product in those provinces, the exposure that they need um, in order to get people to visit them. We really, and we are, we are strong advocates for, we're always on a crusade to get South Africans to visit and travel within South Africa before they take you know, a holiday overseas. And as I said, I think one of the things that this particular show does exceptionally well is it, is it really gives a spotlight to product that is not always in the, you know, front and center in the tourism game. It's those hidden gems that we like to um, really, really give exposure to. And also something they do is, is give a slightly different angle to tourism. Mm -hmm. um, you know, when you travel, you typically think of a hotel. Um, some people who enjoy guest houses and bed and breakfast would think of them first. But the caravan, the camping um, is not always uh, top of mind when you're choosing your, your next destination or your next shot left or your your next family holiday so something that uh, they do as well really well is is place this emphasis on caravanning and camping and being at one with nature which i think south africans are really good at doing yeah camping and glamping so so, so for the uninitiated the glamping is the glamorous camping yeah and and, and there's quite a bit of that as well but as uh, the grading council mm. uh, you are now also grading these sites as well so we do indeed and we have been since 2002 um, the Grading Council has been very active in the hospitality sector, the tourism sector, since the early 2000s. Uh, we grade various different, we call them categories, they're types of product. Um, as I said, from hotels, bed and breakfast, country houses, guest houses. Um, we do game lodges, we do nature lodges, we do backpackers, we do hostels. And one of them is um, caravan and camping. And we've got well over 100 caravan camping facilities around the country that do hold our star grading status. And as I said, this is a fantastic opportunity, this partnership with Footspora to really elevate and give them the exposure they deserve. And of course, we know in September, um, we actually look forward to a short left uh, travel week. Yes. Will there be any distance? on Absolutely. some nice camping and Absolutely. glamping excursions. So we hard at work at South African Tourism, working with our trade partners um, to muster up as many really, really good deals as possible, um, some of them up to a 50% discount that will be made available to you and I, the travelling public, between the 23rd and the 29th of September. We call it Travel Week. Um, we want the, the people, the Joe public out there, to start watching out for it because there's going to be a lot of marketing around it. But you really will have an amazing opportunity to get some amazing destinations, some amazing products some amazing experiences at a really really affordable price during this travel week so look out for it certainly looking forward to it because personally i love uh, you know just stopping over in little quaint towns in the country mm -hmm. and uh, daryl erasmus certainly waiting the appetite this morning thanks so much uh, daryl erasmus who is of course uh, with uh, the uh, tourism grading council of south africa uh, chief quality assurance officer there and i uh, tell you what i'll actually post a video that i took of a very glamorous tent at uh, leuvenoff where i was last weekend and this is what glamping is about i'll actually post it on twitter so with that uh, let's go to headline news with leanne